Hey up YouTube, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to part 12 of my Final Fantasy 7 No Random Encounters Challenge. After escaping on the tiny little plane, we land on a small island to the west of Rocket Town. As we make our way up the hill, Yuffie makes an appearance and Barrett seems to think she's up to something. We then get surprised attacked by some Shinra grunts and... Uh oh, where's all my f***ing materia? Turns out the thieving little bitch Yuffie had a plan to steal the materia all along. Barrett says we should head north and this is where we encounter the now tourist attraction town of Wutai. We bump into a bloke who says he doesn't know Yuffie, but in actual fact, it's her dad. She still holds some resentment for her dad for turning Wutai into what it is now after the war with Shinra, and before we can catch her, she f***s off again. Funnily enough, the Turks are also here taking a little break, but it seems like they're not interested today, so they leave us in peace. After what seems like a that age running around trying to find her, we finally managed to corner her and get our materia back. The little bitch has tricked us again. While this has been going on, some Shinra grunts turn up at the bar where the Turks are drinking to tell them to get off their arses and go and find him. Stoss. Elena isn't too happy about Rina and Rude getting pissed in the middle of the day, so she decides she's going to go and find him alone. Kind of assume they're talking about Sephiroth here, but let me know in the comments below if you think it could be anyone else. Anyway, take two in our mission to get our materia back. We end up in a little building to the north of the village to find that both Yuffie and Elena have been captured by the Sector 6 rat, Don Corneo. We're then forced into a battle with a few more Shinra grunts before we can continue. We then, once again, bump into Reno and Rude. And rather than kicking the shit out of each other, they decide to work together to take down the Don and save Yuffie and Elena. It's now time to scale the Dachau mountain and take on the Don's second little pet, Raps. Right then, YouTube, here we are in Wu Tai, about to take on Don Corneo's second little pet, Raps. As you've seen in the recap video, Yuffie's stolen all his materia. We've got nothing to face this boss with. This boss is f***ing hard. Now, with no materia, it just makes it even worse. Um, doesn't have an awful lot of health, to be fair, but his attacks are very, very strong very powerful so it was really important to make sure that we have at least Barrett going into this boss fight with his limit break because what we can do is we can use mind blow on him to take all his MP away straight away that means he won't be able to cast aero 3 um, which I think does about 1500 damage so if we take away his ability to do that from the off that should give us a little bit more of a fighting chance I wasn't sure who else to go with in this. I didn't know whether to go with uh, Red 13, Vincent, or Aerisith. I've gone for Aerisith based on the fact that she can do Seal Evil, which can paralyze. So hopefully that might let us get some, some cheap shots in. But yeah, it's pointless me showing you the materia, but I might as well show you equipment wise. Um, I believe this boss can actually poison. So, we've given Barrett the gem ring, which uh, will, um, is it the gem ring? Paralyze, petrify, slow, numb. No, it's not. It's a different one, isn't it? Poison and darkness. It's the fairy ring I want. It's the fairy ring I want on him. That can protect him against poison. And also, Aerith uh, has got the star pendant as well. So, that should protect her against poison. There may be a do-over on this. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to go. Um, but we'll crack on and let's see if we can kick wraps his arse, shall we? Right then, right then, right then. Here we go, here we go. Right, Aerisith, Cloud Attack, Barrett, Mind Blow. Straight away, right, that should stop him doing Aero at least. Right, um, Aerisith, I think I've got a Swift Bolt somewhere. Um, somewhere down here. There it is, right, let's just do that. Uh, right, Barrett, attack. Cloud's got his limit. Cross slash, lovely stuff. I'm not sure when Aerith, Aerith gets her limit break here what's going to be better. Um, I don't know whether it's going to be better to have her heal or paralyze him. I'm going to paralyze him, I think. Oh, no, no, we're going to have to do healing wind. I uh, don't know whether I should have... Oh, should I have done that? Should I have done that? Maybe. M maybe that might have been the, the, the wiser option, but we'll, we'll, we'll see, I suppose. 
Right, come on. Keep attacking. I don't think I've got any other items that I can use to um, hit him with. This is just going to be, have to be a case of let's just hope and pray here, I think. This Barrett's looking a little bit poorly here. Right, okay. Okay, okay, alright. Barrett is looking very poorly. Barrett, big shot, please. I'm gonna have to use a high potion if I'm gonna if I'm gonna get chance. Am I gonna get chance? Item. High potion. Barrett. Aerith, keep attacking. Barrett attack. Cloud attack. Just attack, attack, attack. I really, really don't. <laughs> it's a shame I've not got so oh, bad. Right, cloud. Um, high potion yourself, please. Aerith attack. Barret attack. God, my heart is pounding. Come on. Cloud attack. Barret attack. Aerith attack. Attack. Cloud limit. Cross slash, please. Oh my god, come on. It doesn't help. Oh, sh It doesn't help that. Do you know what? I've completely forgot what I was going to say. I'm all out of shop here. Uh, cloud, right. Um, high potion. Yourself, mate. Barrett, attack. Aerith, hi. Oh! Get in! That is wraps. Done. Amazing. Some loads of lovely experience for this as well. Happy days. Didn't need to use Seal Evil in the end, but a few limit breaks and obviously mind blow at the beginning. Completely boxed it off. Right then, and uh, lovely peace ring. Right then, so you come back in a nanosecond and we're going to go through um, the pagoda fights with Yuffie, so um, we'll be right back. Right then, boys and girls, here we are. We're at the pagoda. We're just about to take on the pagoda. This is a series of, I think it's five different battles using only Yuffie, and the aim is to make your way up to the top and win it. The reason that we're going to do this now is because it gives us a hell of a lot of gill. A hell of a lot of gill and a bitter experience as well for Yuffie and, and everybody else because, you know, obviously everybody else gets experience when other characters get experience, but it's like halved, I think. But yeah, the main reason for this is to give us a bit of a guild boost. We've got 24k at the moment, but after this, I think we might be approaching 100k for Gil, which is going to be massive moving forward, especially going into the next episode with the Temple of the Ancients and a, and a few of the things that we need to buy. So, yeah, we're just about to take on the Pagoda. It's Yuffie only, and I'm going to show you how we've uh, we've set her up. So, uh, let's first and foremost go here. So, We've equipped... The, the, oh, actually, no, we don't need the Twin Viper for this. What am I doing? We actually don't... We don't need the Twin Viper for this. We've actually just bought her the Razor Ring. That's what I meant to do. Right, hang on a minute. I need to do some Materia shuffling. I'll be right back. Great, let's start again, shall we? <laughs> right, so we bought the Razor Ring for it, and we've equipped that. Um, so what we've done for Yuffie is we've given her added effect and poison, as well as counter-attack. So hopefully, with the added effect and the poison, you know, that we should have a chance of poisoning whichever boss we're fighting. But also, when they counter, it's also going to have that same effect. So, um, fingers crossed that can happen. We've also given her Restore. We don't need any all materials with this, because it is just Yuffie. I was wondering whether or not to put this on. I was toying with not because it does decrease the strength and magic quite significantly. Uh, sorry, d strength and HP quite significantly. But this is a piece of material we need to start leveling up. So um, I've um, decided that we'll go for that and we'll, we'll put that in. Uh, we've also given a barrier material as well. This is going to be really, really important. And uh, we've also given a lightning and elemental 
this is mainly for the last boss fight because um, the last boss fight, which is against Godo, um, he can do Trine, and that's a lightning-based effect, as you've seen already in the series. So, uh, yeah, this is what we're going with. I've not changed... I'm, I'm probably not going to change this an awful lot, um, if at all, depending on whether we get a little bit stuck. Um, I don't think I'm going to change this, and this is exactly just what we're going to go for th throughout. So, yeah, let's uh, prepare to take on boss number one. Right then, okie dokie, here we go. Right, magic, first of all, let's barrier straight away. Oh, and he's done the exact same thing. Barrier, please, thank you. Now, uh, oh, okay, Grease Lightning, why not? I might actually just, uh, oh, sure, gonna need to restore, I think. And he's regening, regening, regen, regen. Oh, surely it's regen, isn't it? Because regeneration. What a pudding, Matt. Of course that's how it's pronounced. Right, poisoned, lovely. And attack again. And then I think we'll do a cure. Yep, yeah, let's do a cure. And now we'll do a barrier again. After this. I think it's a relatively straightforward one, this. Demi 2, bore off. Well, you're going to have to cure yourself. Well, I'm not doing any magic on you, so that's pointless. Now we'll do Grease Lightning. This might be enough to do it. No, he's got a barrier on him, of course. Uh, cure, please. I think poison might have to help us out a little bit here. It's taking a little bit longer than I thought it might. Oh, Gorky's skill parry is used up fabulous. Oh dear. Oh, hang up, hang up, I need to barrier here or cure. Uh, cure first, then barrier. Oh, he's got reflect on himself. Of course he has. What a pudding. <laughs> Come on, then. Bored of you now. Oh, behave. Come on. Oh, that's a shame. Been nice to have saved that for next then. Cure, please. Barrier, please. Oh, there we go. So I was just about to say I'm getting really bored of you. Right, that's Gorky. Done. So now we're going to move into the next one. Right then, here we go. If memory serves me right, this one can be a little bit of a bugger. Uh, right, so first things first, barrier. Because I think what this one does is it does Rage Bomber and it takes your sadness away. Which can be an absolute ball ache. And then you have to... Um, and then you have to reapply your tranquilizer. And it, there's just not really enough time. So let's see how we get on. Oh, you little bugger. There we go. Lovely. At least he's poisoned. Right, I'm just going to have to make sure I keep my health topped up here. Right, okay, now I need to do a tranquilizer. Tranquilizer, please. Okay, All right, grease lightning. I don't think I should have done that. I think I should have cured. Right, 
Right, cure. And then I'm going to have to barrier again after this. Right, okay. Not doing too badly. I think I'm going to have to cure again here, though. Okay. Now we'll attack. I think I've got a chance to get an attack in here. Now I'm going to... Right, oh, shit, the bed. Right. Oh, you, you absolute turd. You absolute turd. Oh, f um. Oh Christ, I'm not going to do this. 31 health left. I probably should have cured then. Yeah, I definitely should have cured then. Ah, yeah. All right then. Not technically a game over. I know it says game over, but it doesn't take you back to the start screen, so that's not technically a game over. I'm not having that as a game over. Right, let's try again, shall we? Right, let's try again. Okay, right, first things first, barrier. Christ, alive already? Now, cure. Now, hopefully we might have a chance to get an attack in. Oh, two, lovely. Reckon we might get another one in? Yeah, okay, let's try getting another one in. Lovely, poisoned. Oh, fantastic, right. Now we'll do another cure. Now I think this is going to be Rage Bomber, yeah. So, straight away, Tranquilizer. Then we'll do a cure. Then we'll do a barrier. No, we are going to have to... Oh, shit. We're going to have to cure again. And then we're going to have to tranquilize. Tranquilizer, please. Right, cure, and then barrier. Oh, no! Oh, you absolute turd! Ah! Right, so what I've done this time is I've taken that accessory off that she had on initially, and I've actually given her... Um, a ring, I can't remember, was it the peace ring I think I've given her? Now that prevents fury, berserk and sadness, so because she's already got sadness it stays on so hopefully when he does his rage bomber now he shouldn't inflict fury so fingers crossed this one might work what do you mean two on the trot? F no! Jesus! Cure! Cure yourself! Cure yourself, woman! F*** me! You're going to have to cure again here. Oh, maybe not. No, you're alright. Oh, f***. You're going to you're gonna have to do now. Oh, don't you f*** dare. Oh! I really thought that was going to work. Oh my Christ. Oh, he's missed. Fuck. Wasted a cure. Oh, thank God for that. Bleeding hell. That's shake. I think it's shake. Shake. Done. Right, we'll move on to the next one, shall we? Right then, just an update, I've taken that peace ring off now and I've um, given her something else and I wish I could tell you what I've done and I can't. I think it's, um, what is it? I think it's the uh, thing that protects against, uh, no, it's poison and darkness, it's the 
one of the rings, gem ring, I think. Uh, right, what am I doing? Uh, barrier, please. It's a good job I've got that on weight while we're talking to you. <laughs> right. Um, no, let's limit. Lovely stuff. Um, do we... No, I think we just keep attacking, shall we? No, let's just keep attacking. Don't see the point in using the magic. And you can poison him whenever you're ready. Whenever you're ready, Yuffie. Whenever you're ready. Yeah, if memory serves me right, this one just doesn't do anything for absolutely ages and then turns into an absolute unit. There we go, right. I suppose I should be barriering now. Yeah. Let's barrier. Right then, whenever you're ready, mate. Let's do a cure now, shall we? Oh, let's do a cure. And then a barrier. Fan dabby dozy. Now we'll do another cure. Just to be on the safe side. Because that poison should really just be slowly ticking away at him because the absorbs aren't as much as the poison, if that makes sense. Now, I should get a limit in here now, and this, hopefully, fingers crossed, might be enough. Yeah, it is. And that's check off. Done. Right, don't go anywhere. We'll see you for boss four. Interesting fact about this pagoda as well, with the um, with the characters and the bosses. Uh, I'm not quite sure about Gorky and the other one, but uh, Staniv and Chekhov um, are playwrights. Um, Nojima, uh, who wrote the scenario for Final Fantasy VII, um, he was he's a massive fan of their work. And if you get to the, uh, when we get to the top of the pagoda, uh, when we've got Godo, um, apparently um, waiting for Godo, uh, which is a play, is actually one of his favourites. So, um, yeah, a little bit of a little bit of Final Fantasy VII trivia for you there. No, the playwrights or the practitioners? I can't remember. Anyway, I'm I'm not paying any attention to this. What's going on? Uh, right, let's cure, shall we? Right, it's poisoned, which is good. I think this one's relatively straightforward. I can't quite remember. I'm gonna need. Oh, I'm gonna need to put a barrier on here. Oops. Barrier, please. Oh, Christ, on a bendy bus. Now, for cure again. And then, let's do a limit.
it's important for me to keep using her limit break as much as I can because she gets clear, tra clear tranquil after this, which is a healing limit break, which is a, one another one of the reasons why I want her in the party a lot moving forwards because she's going to be one of the only other people who's got a healing limit break. Well, actually, the only other character with a healing limit break. Come on, nah. A bit like the first one. I'm getting a bit bored of you, nah. There we go. And that's Staniv. Done. Right then, we're at the end now. It's now time to take on Godo right at the very top, Yuffie's dad. So come back in just a mo and we'll take on Godo. Right, so the only thing I've done differently for this, all materia are exactly the same. The only thing I've done differently for this is the... Um... Oh. I don't know. Oh, shit. What I was saying is the only thing I've done differently is given her the white cape because this thing can do frogs and small um, and actually I'm now wondering if maybe that was a mistake and I should have I should have given her a star pendant okay um, I'm have to cure again Christ alive I kind of wasn't expecting that straight away throw me off a bit <laughs> Right, well, let's see. Yeah, B Swords all right. So, let's see how we get on. We need to poison him. Poisoning him would be lovely. Bio 2. You little bitch. Oh, Christ. I'm going to die here, aren't I? I am going to die. I am going to die. I am going to die. Oh, bloody hell. Would you poison him, please? Right. Barrier. Please poison him! I don't want to waste a spell. I don't want to waste MP on a spell when you can actually do it normally by just attacking. Um, should I cure here? Yeah, no. Alright, maybe, maybe that was a mistake. Maybe I should have actually gone for an attack then. Let's go for an attack now, though. Ooh, I'm wondering if maybe we might be able to get two in here. Is that a counter? It, oh, no, it wasn't. Uh, right, what's he doing? Sleep pull. Alright, please don't go to sleep. Yes. What's he doing now? Beast sword, another attack. And after this attack, I'm going to cure now. Yes, there we go, finally. Right. Oh, right, I'm going to barrier after this and then I'm going to do limit. Oh, maybe I should have cured. Oh shit, the cure. Come on, cure. Has that just missed? Oh shit. Oh my god. Cure, barrier please. Now cure again. Now cure again after this. And then we'll try the limit. <laughs> Oh dear, this is not going as well as I thought it would. Oh, please don't put it to sleep. Oh, thank God. Is that a sleep spell or is that the toad thing? I'm not paying attention. Right, come on. Grease lightning. Beast sword, I can deal with that. I might have to use an ether here. Do 
is not really something I wanted to do. Now, what are you doing now, mate? Oh, that's the frog small thing, which doesn't work. What are you doing now? Cure. All right, he's actually getting... I don't think we'll be too long now. Um, oh, I should have cured then. What's this? Cure. Yeah, okay. I don't think we'll be too much longer. Because I know once he starts doing that... Oh, you turd! No! Oh, no! Well, that'll wake her up. And I have cured, haven't I? So... Come on. Cure, please. Lovely. Now we'll bury her again. Yeah, barrier. Now cure again after this. Drain? Oh, that's MP, in it? Is that MP or is that HP? I can't remember. Oh, it's HP. All right. So I said I really didn't want that to be MP. Come on. What are you doing? Trying. I'm going to have to cure again. I'll tell you what, it's a bloody good job I've got elemental and lightning in the materia, in the armour. Because otherwise that would be devastating. Grease lightning! Oh, Demi. Bore off. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, shit. This is not good. This is not good. If you're going to attack, please do a beast sword. Okay, he's curing. All right. Right, cure. Right, okay. That's all right. That's okay. Trust that to f***ing crit. <sighs> Alright then, take two. Are you going to poison him at any point, please? Oh, f***. I didn't mean to do that. I've attacked and I didn't mean to do that. I'm dead. 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 That is what happens when you just aimlessly leave your thumb on attack and not pay attention. Right, let's go again then, shall we? Antidote. Are you telling me I've not got a single antidote? Are you telling me I have not got a single antidote? Oh, f***ing hell. Um... Well, this has just made it ten times harder. This has just made this... Uh, at least we're both poisoned, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, this has now made this a little bit harder than it needed to be. How the f*** have I not got any antidotes? They're like the most basic item. Barrier. Right. What are you doing? What are you doing? Bio cure, please. Christ on our oh. God, that's sickening. Right, limit. Oh, off. Oh, no. I've really got to hope that if he does a B-Sword next, it doesn't crit. Well, actually, he needs to do B-Sword next. It's the only thing I think I've got any chance of surviving. Yeah. Yeah, okay, just. Yeah, the poison here is...
actually just given a really, really awful choice here in either don't be poisoned or don't be smalled. So, I've kind of just had to bite the bullet and take that white cape off and make sure that we can't take damage from his poison because that is an absolute bitch. Right, come on then. Let's cure after this, I think. Or should we do another attack? Let's get another attack in. Yeah, because that's just not going to work now. Yeah, perfect. Cool, okay. Well, at least we're not going to be getting mullered by, uh, by poison spells. You can't kill us with Demi. So realistically, the only thing we've got to look out for here is trying and inevitably when we get smalled. Smalled? Littled? Frogged? Well, it's not frogged, is it? But you know what I mean. Right, let's do another attack. Probably get another attack in. Yeah, here we go. Oh, that's just missed. Fantastic. Love that. Love that for you, Yuffie. Right. Cure, please. No, not cure, you pudding. I wanted to bury her. Oh, ball. Oh, well. That's kind of worked out. That's kind of worked out. Okay. Um, never mind. Cure, please. No, not cure. Bury it. Okay, all right. Doing better than the previous couple of runs. Probably can get a couple of attacks in here. Maybe what? Maybe just the one, actually. That was a counter. Lovely. We're going to have to cure here, because if he does try, and I'm buggered. Come on. So we've still got plenty of barrier for now, so we can get another, maybe another couple of attacks in here, which would be nice. One beast sword. Come on. Lovely. Right. Might even be able to get another one in. What's he doing? What's he doing? Cure. Right, okay. When he starts doing cure, you know it's getting close to the end. Right, trying. It's a good job I did not attack then. Right, limit break. After this cure. And then, after the limit break, we'll barrier again. And then, I think we might be cooking on gas, boys and girls. Well, he's not tried to make a little for a while, so I imagine that might be coming up pretty soon. Oh, oh that's not going to work, is it? Thanks. Right, what's he doing now? Uh, another cure? Yeah. Right, well, let's barrier then after this attack. Oh, we've done it. Uh, barrier. And then we'll cure... Yeah, then we'll cure. If he does try now, though, I'm buggered. Oh, you absolute turd. Oh! I'm starting to get really pissed off. Even if this ends up being a 50-hour video, we're not going anywhere else until we've done this. We're just not... It's not happening. Cure. No, no. One eternity later.
Perseverance, come on. I really, really don't want the run to end here. I mean, it's not going to end here, but... Um, it's not ending here, but... I really don't know how much longer I can do this for. Oh, Redden. Oh, bugger. Oh, shit. Oh, no. And I've attacked. And then he'll get another attack in, and I'm not barriered. Oh, don't do this to me. Please don't do this to me. Please. Please. Oh, my God. Please let me get a cure in. Please let me get a cure in. Please let me get a cure in. Oh, well, at least... Oh, thank God for that. Right. Okay, that's not bad. So now, let's... Barrier. And then let's cure. Okay, alright. Okay. I think we might be back on track. I think we might be back on track. Attack. And again. Oh, yes. Oh. And that is Godo. Well, that is Godo and the Pagoda done. Get some lovely experience for Yuffie. Clear Tranquil gained also. And then another 40,000 gil, which should take my total up to, well, whatever it were, probably about 60,000, something like that. Lovely stuff. And that's an ultimate limit break as well, which we're never going to use. If you want to see what's happened in the No Random Encounters series so far, you can check out these videos right here. And if you want to see what's been happening in my Final Fantasy VII Rebirth playthrough, you can check out these videos right here. Thank you ever so much for watching, guys. Please do give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more content just like this. And don't forget to check that little notification bell to let you know when these videos do go live. My name's Matt, better known as the Yorkshire Gamer, and thank you very much for watching.